Hoisted high into the skies of Paris, this gilded cross is a milestone of sorts for the Notre Dame Cathedral. With minute precision, it was fitted into place on the site's rebuilt spire. Destroyed in a massive fire on April 15, 2019, it is a significant step in returning Paris's skyline to as it was before the blaze. Designed by the 19th century architect Eugène Viollet-le-Duc, the spire's oak structure, at its full height of 96 meters, is still covered in scaffolding, for its roofing still needs to be installed. Day and night, Parisians look up and watch the progress of the construction work. I wanted to take some photos because this work is quite memorable. It's the beginning of life. It's coming back to life. It's the symbol of a rebirth. We're capable of rebuilding it as it was before, and we'd like to thank all those who said no to cement. Emmanuel Macron has vowed to rebuild the Gothic cathedral exactly as it was. But such a move has sparked controversy over the dangers of the cathedral's lead roofing. Highly toxic, especially to children, critics say fitting the roof and spire again with up to 500 tons of lead doesn't make sense. Hundreds of workers are nonetheless plowing ahead, with the goal that the cathedral looked done from the outside by the Olympics. They then plan to open the site to its 12 million yearly visitors in exactly one year's time, by December 2024. The absolute final touches, though, of this medieval monument are expected by 2030.